How's it going, guys? Coast to Living back with the Golf Club. I'm going to play another round here, and I got a request from Richard Hunt to try out Blue Ridge Plantation. So I have never heard of that one, never seen it. So let's give it a shot. Um, this stuff hasn't, well, there's a little bit of this change on the right. Par 3 practice. Okay, this is cool. Um,. All right, so public courses, search. Let's just type in uh, Blue Ridge. There it is, Blue Ridge Plantation. 41 plays, 18 holes, medium difficulty, 7.9 rating. Let's go. Here you go, Richard. See how it is, par 72. I like that. Not a fan of the odd par courses. I like my threes and my fives. Make sure we got them. Ooh, my, oh. Cryptic played this course. Shot it one under. Oh, we're going to keep him on. Uh, shoot, did I screw that up? Uh, Cryptic, we're going to play your ghost ball. First time I've done it. And since it's you, it's me and you. Me against you, man. So Tim Wilson UK is Cryptic Grifter from our old Tiger videos. We had a lot of good matches there. He picked this up. He got a new graphics card, so he's actually able to run it. He did get it the day it came out, or maybe the day after, but his uh, graphics card at the time couldn't run it, so we weren't playing at all. We probably played about five matches the other night, five rounds, and it was a good time. Um, so here, this is the course. So the cool thing about the ghost balls is that it does... Um, like... Cryptic won't hit his ghost won't hit his second shot until I hit my second shot or on my second shot. So you still feel like you're kind of playing with him. He's got yardage markers in the middle. Um, he must have a different wind though. That's one thing that's different. There's definitely different wind when you're playing with somebody. I have so that I had eight or so coming into me there a little bit. He obviously did not have that because he hit the ball farther. So now you'll see his second shot go up. And then he'll kind of wait there. We can see if he puts out or whatever before we hit. So it's pretty cool in that way. I, I don't play many ghost balls, so this is kind of a new thing. Okay, so we got put this win, but that is also going to come over. Um, I didn't really pay attention to these greens. If they're uh, fast or whatever. Of course it's medium, so I'm assuming the greens aren't fast. Well, Cryptic put one right there. So we should see if he made his putt from here. I would think. There it goes. Yeah, he knocked it in. That's yeah, pretty cool. This is a pretty flat green. I barely... What happened? I had a stutter in my thing. I swear to God, it was like a little slowdown. That was terrible. Okay, <laughs> wow. Well, that should have been a birdie. And that should have been a par. Oh my gosh. Not a good start. It is a little weird putting in this game. Uh, you gotta get used to it. I'm, I'm used to it by now, but every once in a while when I start around, I kind of like forget that I, I always hit it short. So I get back in my groove. So here we got a little bit of a cryptic cut the corner. And he hits some trees and he's in the woods. Awesome. Oh, he's gonna be pissed off that I happen to show this round. <laughs> it's just chance that he played this course. Because he's only played it. Oh, he's really only had this for a couple of days playing it. So he must have played it today. Um, because I th like, last night was when we played a whole bunch. So he could have played it the day before. I can't remember exactly when he got his card. So he's in the shit. <laughs> so we can go up to a top view, actually. We can watch his shot from here. And he gets it out. And he gets it long... Looks like he's a little long there, but I hope I wouldn't have wanted whatever shot he had. I'll take that shot. 
Sit, sit. Now it's just putt. Let's see how he comes out of that beach. Now I'm curious. No, they'll probably just play his next shot and wait for me to hit my next shot. So if he doesn't happen to make that, which he didn't. Ooh, or, or did he? Oh my god, what a shot! Did he actually do that? That is crazy. He spun that back. He been freaking out. Now he's probably happy I'm showing this. I can't putt after that. Well, what a start for Cryptic. How do you end up one under? Something's going to happen. Ooh, what a cool hole, bridge. Is this a par 3? Yeah, 183. Pins back, so we got a little bit of room. God, that wind is really going to hurt me. And he laid one right next to the cup again. Look at this guy. He has that, how do you shoot one under, Cryptic? So, uh, I, gotta, I can't wait to find out what happened to him. So 178 with that downhill, but then we got that wind. So it's probably 10, 188 maybe. So we might go about 180. We'll be hitting that 5 iron. Let's go about 180, 182, 181. I don't know if that... I haven't figured out the wind yet. In Tiger, 6 mile an hour in my face, I always added 10 yards, and it worked out pretty good. So that's what I'm going to try to do here, and that did not work out very good. And I'm in the drink. Well, it's not that. It's more than 10 yards. It's more than 10 yards. So I hit 180. It's 178. It says 188. Wow, yeah. When I, I hit 182. Let's go about 180. Let's go 187. That thing. So six mile an hour wind in my face. Is uh, that's a pretty good shot there. So I want about, I want about four, about thirteen, about thirteen. Wow, he started three and I went about thirteen to fourteen yards with that six mile hour in my face. I gotta start trying to remember all these things. That's a cool looking hole. Give me a three wood. Don't like that, especially with the wind in my face. We're gonna switch to a driver. I would normally try to draw this, but that wind's gonna kind of draw it for me, so I'm just gonna play it out to the right. Let the wind take it around that corner. But we're not having a good start. This is a cool course so far. I really like this course right now. Big fairways here, but cool rolling the way that the hills are. Realistic. And uh, it's pretty. It's a pretty course. Oh, Cryptic's short there. So 65 yards uphill. So that's like 22 two yards. Um, this is a par 5 though. So we're looking at about 230, gotta hit this. Let's just hit a 5 when we get it up there. Probably, I might not make it to the green with this. Hopefully I'm not in that beach. Give me a good kick. That's fine, I'll take that. Par 5, got a little wedge, a little chip, even though I'm like... Defying gravity here for my golfer, so who knows what's going to end up happening. I think it's about 17 yards. I don't know how much time I'll have to play on this. Let's just put it about right here. That'll work. Sit. Nice. Let's see what Cryptic's ball did here. He didn't hit yet. I, I maybe I went too fast. Oh, that's gonna be a, that's gonna. Be a tough one. So that's interesting. He's not actually done yet on his score. 
Even though he's actually, yeah. Interesting. Huh. Okay, 315 par. Yeah, he's still on his fourth stroke on that other hole. Now he just finished the hole. And we can see what he got. Maybe. It looks like he must have parted. it. Okay, so we got wind in our face. Yeah, because he's hitting here. 92 down. That's third. Wow. And he's in the junk. So we got a 30... 280. I guess we should hit the driver here. I don't want to go on the beach. I'd rather be a little long with this. That's going to be a lot of long, I think. Yeah, not really. It's going to land short, but that driver's going to roll. Yeah, I should have went three wood for sure. I almost wish that rolls off the green, so I don't have to putt this. I'd rather chip it and get closer. This is insane. This is an insane putt. With eight inches up. And the other thing about this game is you cannot, um, you can get down and kind of see the putt a little bit on the marker view, but since they only shows the grid around that, the closer part of the hole, looks like it's going left to right a little bit. I have no idea what this is doing. What's it doing up at the putt hole? God, it's hard to even tell that. I think it's going right to left. Okay, I'm going to play this pretty big left to right to start with. I think it's going left to right in the beginning. I probably want to get it halfway there. No, it's going right to left. What a horrible shot. It's almost impossible because you do not know. It's hard to tell what you're doing here. Um, on these first putts when you can't read the green. Sit down. I'll take that. So we're going to end up par in this hole. No, we're not. We're going to end up bogey in this hole, I think. It was on in one. Oh, well, on in one and three, but should be a par if I can make this. Oh, he hops. Alright, we got to turn this around. We're not starting well here. Need some birdies. Okay, so this is downhill. 469 is a cool looking hole. This is a very cool course. Don't go in the water. 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 What a horrible round of golf. Oh my god, I didn't go in. I thought I'd at least, I didn't think I'd go that far. Oh, scouts, you're blowing it. Okay. This is an interesting lie, to say the least. Heavy rough, 61 to 83%. Oh my lord. And we have 186. That's the best club we can hit. I really don't want to go on that beach. Yeah, you know, we got you know, I'm just going to hit it because we got a lot of room. Even if we go on that beach, there's a lot of room on the green before the cup. So, yeah, we didn't make it there anyway. So the the, sh the w shot out of the beast shouldn't be too tough. We should have a pretty good chance to par from here, hopefully. What's this green looking like? Kind of going left to right. Sit. Alright, get a par out of that. Could have been worse with a start. That weird lie. Okay.
course it's a medium difficulty rating, but it doesn't look, it's not that easy. It doesn't feel like it's that easy. I said I'm not really playing well, but I guess you can play on an easy course and not play well. I guess, 135. Try to land this a little bit short. These greens aren't rolling too crazy, and it's an eight iron, so it should check up a little bit. It's still a little too long. That wind took it a little bit more than I thought. Uh, this is going to be a nightmare type of putt here. Come on, turn. Ah. Two forty seven par three downhill. What a bunker. What a cool looking bunker. And there's a lot of room here, which is good. Because obviously we're hitting a wood into this. And the way these greens roll, the pin is in the front, but there's a big slope in the front. You gotta get up that slope or else you're gonna stay down. Let's see what Cryptic does. He gets over. He's on the back side. It's not a bad ball. It's a tough little shot here. Negative forty one feet though, so we're looking at about 13 off of that or so, so we're looking at about 230, 233, 232 with the hill, something like that. Yeah, that's a rough, rough estimate. With that wind, we're looking at 240. We're looking about this club, really. I guess that's all we can really do. That's probably going to be horribly long. Checked up for a second, but nah. I apologize if you hear a little bit of uh, anything on the TV. I got the Blackhawks playoff game going on next to me. And it's a replay. I actually I already know what happens in the game. I still wanted to have it on and see it. So, I don't think you can hear it. But if you can, then I apologize. I've been trying to work on my chip in when I have chip shots here. It's still not very. I'm still not very good at it. It says all feel, and that was not very good. Roll, damn it! Ugh, tough front nine, huh? Where are we at? We're still at one over. We got a 600 yard par 5. We got a little bit of. Ooh, look at this nonsense. I think I'm hitting 3 wood. I'm gonna be safe. With that little tad of wind, I don't want this to roll through somehow. It's probably gonna be well short. Or it may actually. Yes, yeah, it's gonna be well short. But, you know what? I don't care. Well, I'm not getting there in 2 anyway. It's uphill, second shot, beach up there. So, yeah, there's no way, to, there's no reason to chance it. I'd rather give myself a wedge coming in. If I'm, right, these days, after playing a bit, as long as I'm within about 100 yards from the pin hole, I can usually get that wedge pretty close. That's a massive uphill, though. So, looking at about one... Um, 112 or so. Let's just get that 9 iron about 1, 109. Because that little bit of wind might do a little something. A little something, something. That should work. Nice ball. See if Cryptic got his chipping down yet. He would. He's me and him would. Well, he would probably. He's probably a little bit better than me and Tiger at chipping in. He's just a tad short. All right, got a bird. Nice. What is this nonsense? Two seventy-five par four. 
with a very interesting setup here. Now I'm really curious what he does. What's Cryptic going to do with this hole? This is an odd... Does he go for it? No, he's hitting the... He's playing it smart. I don't think there's any way to not play it smart. I don't think we can technically... Just see if I bring the dry route, what can I do? Yeah. How do we bring the five wood out from here and we play a bit of a play a bit of a fade. Try to fade it over those trees. Don't go in the trees. No, I'm gonna hit the tree. I didn't have to get enough loft on that thing. Yeah. What do we got left? Ah, it's not terrible. Well, That's about 17 yards. I gotta add to this shot or so, I think. Something like that. So looking at 120. Plus. A lot of green pins way up front, too. Be the club. Come on. Be the club. Be the club. That's pretty nice. I'll take it. Okay. So it's going to barely go. Nice. Cryptic ran it by there. Birdie. All right, we're getting this birdie train going. Maybe we'll end with a respectable score here. Well, respectable's probably even these days in this game still, but a good score. Stay left with that wind. Stay left with that wind. No, don't do that. No, don't. No, you, you bitch. Stop. Wow. Got lucky. Another cool layout. Little tough shot coming into this thing. Very cool course. Okay. Uh, 116. I may favorite this course. I really like it. 116. We're flat here. I'm gonna go a little right naturally, but that wind's gonna blow it back. Nice ball, cryptic. Got a little bit of room to work with, so I'm gonna hit this a little tad. What's well, a nine iron? This thing's gonna stick. So let's go a little, maybe a couple yards long, because of that. Well, we gotta go a little. Actually, probably let's go about there. That may be a little longer than I want. I'm not sure how that three mile no, it's actually gonna be right there. Yeah. The three mile wind wasn't directly in my face, but it was gonna still knock it down a tad. Get in. Nice. The birdie train has begun. Nice birdie cryptic. And a pick up hill again, so that's one twelve, about fourteen. Gonna add about 14, and then that three mile hour win, or so we're gonna add at least, at least it's probably eight. So we're gonna about about 121 or so, yeah. Well, oh my God, that green is a tiny. He stuck it. Wow, what a shot. Get up. Oh no, I was right on the edge of being a really good ball. Oh boy, and who knows what's going to happen here. At least it didn't land directly in the beach. One of the great things about this game too is the fact that it totally... If you land in the beach, it's like just land straight in like a, you know... I don't like this flop shot. I don't like that much difference between my shots. See if I can just do a pitch out of here. Get it closer to that nine yards. I'd like to hit it about yeah, twelve or thirteen or so. Sit. Oh yeah, that'll work. Anyway, if you hit the ball on the beach. Oh, lag. Go in, go in. Oh, thank you. Wow, terrible lag. I almost could have missed that because of that lag. I 
Oh, my computer, my laptop's overheating. This is what happens with this laptop. It's a good laptop, but overheats massively at times. And for about 10, 20, 30, well, about 30 seconds, 20 seconds, it'll run at about two frames a second until it cools off. And I have a fan underneath it. So now we have a slow motion view of this hole. This is actually not what, how it's supposed to be. You know, it looks like a cool slow motion view, but it's not. So it should kick back up for me in a second here. There it goes. So that just it overheats for a minute and it it kind of shuts the computer down and it, you know lowers a lot of just to try to get the heat out, I guess, or whatever. I don't know what it does. It's annoying, is what it is. And I have one of those fans underneath my laptop to blow an air into it. And it still does that. That's a good ball. Alright, so Cryptic at this moment is still up on me. What kind of sucks is I know what he shot. In a way. Because now that I know, I'm, pre I'm pretty sure he said he shot one under. No, Now that I know he shot one under, I know I know that I don't have to really... I know where, you know I know what's going to happen. It's like Back to the Future 2. I got the almanac from the future so I can... Make my bets, become a millionaire. Uh, so we're going 41 yards. The wind should not affect a shot from that close. Yeah. Get in. Money. But yeah, knowing that he's shot, we're gonna shoot one under. Lessens the, um, you know, suspense for me. I wonder if there's a way I can not see his score on that first screen, but just actually still play against him. That would be cool. What is this nonsense? Big dog leg left. So if I go five wood. It's really, I don't think there's any point to try to, I mean, it's just, it would be stupid, yeah. Cryptic's smarter than I am. It would be stupid to try to cut that corner. I don't think it's really going to give me any real advantage. I'm probably going to hit the bunker, trying to draw it. So let's just hit the 5 boy. looks like that's what Cryptic hit. Well, he might hit the 3-iron, eh, probably not. We still got a long ball here, though, that's the problem, but... Green's uphill and he's small. So he's forcing you to have a long iron into this green almost, and he's making it a difficult green on top of it. So that's a little little rough. We're on a side hill lie, and we have the winner going left right to left, so. That's not gonna sit. Long, cryptic was long, and I'm long. All right, let's try to chip again. Ooh! Oh, he almost spun one back in again. Uh, he's getting good at the. Uh, um, and I'm still I'm not that good at <laughs> at chipping. That was a pitch, though. He didn't chip that. What I probably should have done. I would have been closer if I did that, but I want to work on my chips. Got it. Alright, so we are three under, both tied to three under, going into 15. This is a cool looking hole. It's like way up here. It just drops down to like who knows where. If you if you miss this fairway, your ball's gone. It's down into the valley. So if I ever do this again, where I'm playing with a guy like we know, because I'm starting. You know, if you're if you're on Steam, send me a friend request or you know, Scal's three eleven is my Steam account. Send me a request or something so we can you know, get some ghost balls. Look at this nonsense. Are you shitting me? 
What a cool hole. Well, Cryptic definitely went for it. You need, literally got to hit that about, what, 220 limit, 220 to have an even chance of 115, so that's 15 yards, 2, 233, this Blackhawk game is intense. Let's hit the 5 woods, see what happens. Ah, the wind's in my face, just a tad, that may screw me. That may screw me a little bit. It blew. Yeah. Oh, rock. Oh, no. Stop. Oh, oh this is not going to be good. Is that like a lawnmower right here in the game? I don't think so. Oh, this is. This is. And in the heavy rough. We got 22 yards. We got to play this about 90%. So we got to take about 10% off of whatever we're hitting. So this is going to go about 27 yards. So we want to hit this about 25, 20, 25 yards, 26 yards, and hope this works. Oh no, we're uphill though. Another seven, so that's 29. So now we want to hit this about 33 yards. Let's see if this works. Lag, lag. And I hit it 50% because of the lag. Unbelievable. The computer slowed down in mid backswing and screwed my shot. Oh, that's Toro. I was, I'm really curious if that would have been good. Shit. Okay, so now we have to figure this out again. So we're 17 yards away, up 16, so that's about 5, about 22, 22 yards or so. And we got the same type of lie, so we want to hit this about 25 yards. Once my computer gets back in check here. There it goes. I think. Yeah, there we go. Yep, I think my first shot would have been good. I, I had the math down. But my computer was screwed me over. Please. We got a par. Please allow them to send me my new computer faster than it was supposed to come May 8th or something. I need it now. <laughs> I can't take this anymore. It's a laptop. It's a nice laptop, but it just has these little issues, and it's driving me absolutely bonkers. So that is 30 to 5. i got to knock about off. So that's about 175. One, no, 165? I hope it's about 160, probably 160 something. Even less with that wind. Play this 158 and see what happens. Uh, that, that just doesn't seem right. But that is massively downhill. Let's try it. Well, I hit it how I wanted it. So let's see if it was the right call. Actually, it was. It was a pretty good call. I actually didn't think they had a chance. I thought it was going to be in the water. I thought it was going to be way short, but I had it right. I had the math right. Okay. Sit, sit, sit. That was a tough putt. I didn't think I was going to. I pretty much knew I was going to make that, so that's not a bad little lag putt. Gave it a chance. So we're three under. Cryptic's a two under. He bogeyed that par five. So anyway, I was saying, oh, what I was saying is, if I do this where I'm playing a guy, um, I, I started saying that. That send me friend requests if you have the game, and if you, we end up playing the same course, you know, you have your ghost ball in the game. That's cool. And before the round, for now on, I won't say what the other person shot. Like, and like this is the first time I've done it. So, yeah, I kind of said, you know, Cryptic shot one under. This is a crazy hole uphill like that. 
and I said crazy you know critic shot one under so we know he's gonna shoot one under I'll try not to say that for if we do this again with other ghost balls so it keeps a little suspense into the match and see who can win you know if I can beat the other ball so uh, I can still choke though and lose this I'm only three under so um so that's 20 and then another 26 that's like 28 or so yards wow so about 165. So we're going to land the 6 iron. How's the pin looking? Is it front? No, it's back. That's a crazy looking hole. So it's going to roll a little bit, So, but that wind... Let's see if we got it right. Cryptic got it right, and we got it right. Look at that. I think I might be inside you, Cryptic. Maybe. Oh, yeah. What a ball. Let's see if he made it. He shoots one under, so either he makes that. Yeah, he made it. Oh, did I get lag? I almost had lag there, I think. I got nervous. Nice birdie. Oh, so he bogeys 18. So that doesn't bode well for me. What is this? 475 par 4 all downhill. That's a massive shot. That is massive. Looks like he hit it straight. So he's going to be in... It looks like he's in good shape. Yeah, that, I wonder how far this ball is going to go. I only have... Oh, oh, she had more than one mile an hour wind on my back. Should kick right for that hill. Yeah, okay. Keep going, keep going. Three, forty. Oh, I keep your ass cryptic, I think. Oh no, he beat me, I think. Oh, three feet. What a cool hole, finishing hole. Alright. Great course. I like this course a lot. So there's no, oh, I don't like that though. There is no room on that pin. Yeah, he's in the beach. No wonder he bogeys this. That is a nasty pin. It's almost impossible to play that in front. We got a nine iron, so we can play big time spin and maybe get past it. So that's one, and then so that's, it leaves me uh, 17. So that's about 15 yards under. So we're looking at about. 111 we want to hit this. We want to hit this about one. We want to go big time. So let's go... I guess we go 9 iron. About 109. Let's try that. See what happens here. If we can get this just past the hole and check it up. That's what we're looking for. Or just in front of it. There's like a little bit of room. little bit of room. Yes. Oh, it's not going to check though. Hit the fringe. That was as close as you can get to a really perfect shot, almost. Maybe about a yard longer, and I maybe would have checked. Ah, he hit it in the bunker twice. That's what happened. We can drill this. This is a good end of a round. It's a tough hole. Get in. Nope, missed it. Damn it. Oh, stop. Killed it. Get in. All right. I'll take a par. That's a tough... Oh, we hit the pin. <laughs> All right, we shot four in there. That's a good round. That is a cool course. I like it. I had a tough start. Two bogeys of the first three holes. I had no bogeys the rest of the day. Just a tough beginning to that round. I remember that first hole. I had a terrible first putt, and I barely hit hard enough to get anywhere near the hole. It caused me to get that bogey. I really like that course. I'm going nine on that. Um, I'm, and I'm going to favorite it. Very cool. I only have a few favorites. So, if I favorite it, I really like it. I like that layout. Alright, well, cool. Well, thanks for watching, guys. I'll try to get this up as soon as I can. And, uh, see you guys later. Take care.